Welcome back everyone to Willstopia and we are back at the beginning of the tunnel where we need to take care of this thing because I wish to move the nether portal and what I want to do with it is to place the portal right there. So let's take care of that and what I want to do with that matter is to grab some spruce stairs and you're going to connect the stairs like this create an end to the stairs here then we're going to put the nether portal here repeat that on the other side because we're going to create a little bit of an exit over there now of course if I'm going to place a nether portal there I'll need obsidian all right good thing I remembered my there we go good thing I remembered my flint and steel been rather embarrassing to pull that thing down and have no flint and steel on me because I've got no flint with me so I wouldn't have been able to rebuild that so therefore let's take care of that now we're going to start building that up. Now, I'm going to be making this three wide. I only have 11 obsidian here, so I'm going to have to grab some obsidian from this thing. And that's going to take me a while to pull it down. And now we have our portal. We have this coming down to here. And then on the other side, we have this. Now I still have the old portal there. I had just enough obsidian that I could just grab a couple pieces there without disrupting it, though I will get rid of that before I am all finished. Now, this end only exists so that I can put a door here. The idea there is I can I'll put a button there and a button there. That gives me a way to get in and out. And that should do there. Which means now all I have to do is light. Oh, I've already have it in my inventory. Very well, let's light her up. Now, let's see if it actually takes me to my base. Do I sync up properly? Okay, good. Now, if I port back, probably to the old one. Although, I, okay, I already synced up to that one. Good. So that means I can safely. Maybe I should give myself two spaces there, and I may switch that to a wooden button because I think I get a little bit more time if I use wood but that'll be for later because first thing I gotta do is take down the old portal so that is no longer sitting around here and this will take a little time with the old portal gone and the new portal now operating it is time for us to head down to the other end where we need to finish up this tunnel and connect with Stina Rose's tunnel and all will be happy and I can be able to get to and from my base and everything like that. <laughs> we'll see how well it works. Alright, now here's the stairway that I created at the end of the last episode. And the question is, what am I going to do with it? Because... I have to go up continuously so I've thought of uh, an idea of how to handle that and of course we will need a stair step ceiling now unfortunately we need a whitish thing in the middle otherwise it just won't look right so therefore my candidate for handling that is going to be quartz now quartz is pretty expensive and I don't exactly have a huge budget, but 
I've been spending all this time in the nether, and if you're going to get anything out of it, it is going to be a great deal of quartz. So that'll be one of the perks of how I've been playing lately. So therefore, let us get this up like that, up like this. And we'll stair step this. First, we'll take care of the andesite side. that for side one and then let's take care of the other side make sure that we have some nice bit of coverage there but not too high because we don't want to foul up our pattern there up and away and hopefully uh, this will give us what we intend Actually, I think we need one more step up like that if I am uh, uh, what do I do here? Ah, okay, because we've got that going like that. No wonder. And I should also then do the same with my Oh yeah, I am running low on my on my andesite there, but I do have stone bricks, which is a... Oh no, I don't want to go too up like that. I just want to go... Right, we just need to go one... Just plop one on top of each, and I think uh, that'll do. If I'm wrong, then I'm sure we could always correct it afterwards. <laughs> Can't get the simple ones right, right? All right, now let's back to here. Down, <sighs> down, down. Oh, come on! All right, good. That's all done. Good. Get rid of that. Now we're also going to need some torches. Occasional torches in here. I tend to put it there. There. Good. So now I can see. And now to get my stairs to go upwards. That's going to be the real tricky part. Oh, <laughs> that's not the way to start. A misplaced block. Not a good way to start. Alright, now I think what I really need to do is to. like that. Ah, okay, that is too low, so therefore I should go one higher there. That's All right, and see if I could go up this pattern all the way up. And then everything should be fine. Of course, I get up to the top and remember that, no, everything is not fine because I forgot one of the fundamental things I said before, and that is we needed something light in the middle, and that's where the course will go. So, therefore, there, 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 and there. There you go. All right, nice. Yeah. Okay. I think that'll do. Of course, the quartz is a little bit too clean, but I can't think of any other nice white blocks that will fit there. Mm, so I think I need to add at least uh, one more layer of stone here and figure out what to do with the sides. Now, I do have uh, that little bit there, but I think well, I will have to fill that in, I guess. And yeah, I think I'll be able to. Actually, this might not work. 
Well, if it does it, good to find out now rather than later, I guess. Alright, and let's try that. And actually, I think that'll do. Let me finish it up. And here you have it. Good. Interface as well. I think that interface as well. We go all the way down. And of course, and out. This is how it looks up. We're back to normal. And then we can go straight on across where we're going to have to go up a little bit more soon afterwards, but not as steeply as we did so far. Actually, one possibility is that I just continue climbing there and then go straight from there. Hmm. I should have thought of that earlier. And here's the result. I've come up here. I've made my transition over here. I'm now flat and I have did the additional climbing here. So you can see now I am right about the same level as on here. Now I have to connect up to there. Now I'm not going to do the route that I did before because I don't think it would be good to go around having a long diagonal like this. So instead I am going to cut through the nether rack over there, come down this way, turn around here, and meet up I would say right about here and then I could make another turn right there I was considering going up there and climbing up there but I already have a path here so maybe it's best for me just to cut through that way but first I'll have to dig a bit of, bit of a hole to all the way across there and this will give me some more netherrack. I've been running out of netherrack in doing this so therefore getting a little bit of extra of that will help with my scaffolding and I just hope I don't run into too much lava along the way but I'm sure that is going to be inevitable which means I should Dump some netherrack there so that I have something to. F Ooh, quartz. Especially considering that I've been using quartz in order to build my stairs. Any extra that I can find will come in quite handy. Well, I'll finish cutting through this and mining this quartz. Actually, I'm in the nether. I better not. I say don't dig directly down. I'd say. In the nether, you sometimes have to be careful digging to the side unless you have an out. All right, now let me get to digging and I'll be back. I have finished my little digging session. And I also started putting in a little bit of extension to the stone and the andesite. And I ran out of andesite right about there. I also ran out of stone brick, but I should easily be able to renew that. The andesite will have to be mined. And I continued the road down to here until I got out of the tunnel. And I turned around a couple times. And of course, I have my second set of stairs. And I'll have to get all the way through this for another tunnel trip. So I'm going to have quite a few of these. But we are getting near the home stretch to turn around there. And it's flat the rest of the way. So no more having to worry about going up. I do have a few more pl planks to put down there, slabs to put down there. And then I am here at Stina Rose's location. And I'll have the tunnel done. But I'm not going to be able to do that today because I'm going to have mine, have to mine some resources. If I'm lucky, 
I will have this all done by the time I return for the next episode. But I am not going to place any large sums of money on that happening. So I'll be ne I'll be back next time either to finish this up or if I have finished it up to show you the final results. And hopefully I'll have a nice safe tunnel to get from the nether to my base. We'll find that out in the next episode of Finally Plays Minecraft Wells Topia.